Students speak their transfer truth, stories and strategies. What do students say it takes to thrive through transfer? When students can speak their transfer truth, we learn a lot about what impacts their journey. Talking directly to over 800 students struggling to get to the university, the RP groups through the GATE study identified four key factors for building students' transfer capacity. The first factor, university affordability. Students told us that they do not always understand the true university cost and associated expenses, as well as available assistance, including and beyond what financial aid provides. The second factor, pathway navigation. Students told us that they need timely and accurate information about each stage of the transfer journey from entry all the way through the transfer gate. The third factor, school life balance. Students told us they need assistance with balancing work, family, and school responsibilities while they're working on their education. The fourth factor, support network. Students told us they need to be connected with caring, encouraging, and supportive individuals. We also learned that some factors carried more weight for certain student groups than others, suggesting that colleges and universities embrace unique strategies to increase their transfer success. So how do these factors show up in students' lived experiences and what do they say they need to get through the gate? Meet Gerardo Chavez. My name is Gerardo Chavez. I am a student at Riverside City College, and currently I am applying for transfer. As a matter of fact, I just completed my UC tag. Based on my experiences, one challenge that I found in the transfer process is finding the information by yourself. I am a first generation student, uh, so that means that I have to be independent and look for the information by myself. However, I have received support from my own college. I have met with counselors who they're able to pinpoint me to admission counselors. And by meeting with those admissions counselors, I'm able to receive information from their end, as well as advice or any insight that they may have. Uh, one example would be uh, going over my transcript and also giving me more information about their admissions. What are they looking for? And what is their criteria? Based on my transfer experience, one advice that I would give to students is start as soon as possible. Don't wait until the last minute to fill out your application. You need time to review your application. You need time to get information, as well as you need more time to answer the questions that they're asking you. One advice that I would give to the colleges and universities is to have patience with the transfer students. We're living in a pandemic in online instruction. That alone is very hard. And by making the information more accessible, we can guarantee that students are going to feel less stressed out and they will receive the information that they deserve. In my, in my case, by receiving the information it just gave me peace of mind. Transfer students need colleges and universities to take a more holistic and integrated approach to ensure they reach their goals. A bachelor's degree and upward mobility for themselves and their families. When we listen to students, we can help them thrive through transfer.